Throughout the past few centuries, humanity has utilized blast furnaces to produce iron. The steelmaking method using a blast furnace is the most efficient way to produce iron to date. In the process of blast furnace operation, coal and iron ore are processed into coke and sintered ore in the form of lumps, respectively, then charged into a blast furnace where the coal melts the iron ore to produce pig iron at higher than 1500 degrees Celsius. However, carbon dioxide is generated during this process. POSCO has developed Finex, a technology that enables the utilization of coal and iron ore without any prior treatment. The traditional iron making process involves both a reduction reaction to remove oxygen from iron ore and a melting reaction to melt the reduced iron ore which occurs simultaneously within a blast furnace. The Finex process separates the reduction and melting reactions as reduction happens in fluidized bed reactors while melting and the generation of reducing gas occur in the melter gasifier. Unlike blast furnaces, Finex can produce pig iron without the need for sintering and coking processes by directly utilizing fine iron ore and non-coking coal. Since 2003, POSCO has been producing high-quality molten iron through the Finex process. POSCO aims to achieve carbon neutrality by 2050 by developing hydrogen reduction iron-making technology based on Finex's fluidized bed reduction technology. The core of POSCO's hydrogen reduction iron making is to replace all unit processes generating carbon dioxide in the Finex process with processes that use hydrogen and electricity. To begin with, substituting the Finex melter gasifier, which relies on coal, with an electric smelting furnace would lead to a significant decrease in carbon dioxide emissions. Electric smelting furnaces can be connected to existing steelmaking processes such as converters, even when using low-grade iron ore that has been reduced by hydrogen reduction as a raw material. It is possible to produce high-grade steel such as automobile outer plates, gigasteel, and electrical steel sheets, which are difficult to produce in general electric furnaces. The slag generated during the process of melting reduced iron ore in electric smelting furnaces can be utilized as a carbon-reducing raw material in the cement industry. Replacing the Finex melter gasifier with an electric smelting furnace would require a different reducing gas supply to the fluidized bed reactor. In hydrogen reduction iron making, hydrogen replaces the reducing gas. In the case of Finex, Reduced iron is produced using carbon monoxide and some hydrogen in a fluidized bed reactor. In hydrogen reduction iron making, reduced iron will be produced through a 100% hydrogen reduction reaction in a fluidized bed reduction reactor. Now, by producing iron through this completed process, is it really possible to achieve carbon neutrality? To truly achieve carbon neutrality, the hydrogen utilized in the steel production process must be generated without any carbon dioxide emissions. There are several types of hydrogen produced without carbon dioxide emissions. Blue hydrogen, turquoise hydrogen, and green hydrogen. Blue hydrogen is produced from fossil fuels, but it captures and eliminates the carbon dioxide generated. Turquoise hydrogen is produced by the thermal decomposition of natural gas into hydrogen and solid carbon. Green hydrogen refers to hydrogen produced by the electrolysis of water. Additionally, the electricity used in electric furnaces must be generated using energy sources that do not emit carbon dioxide, such as renewable energy and nuclear energy, in order to achieve a truly carbon-neutral steelworks. POSCO will secure the core technology for producing hydrogen without emitting carbon dioxide as well as the capacity for transportation, storage, and utilization. Along with hydrogen business, POSCO is actively responding to the development of steel materials needed to build future energy infrastructure, such as renewable energy and nuclear energy. What will the steelworks of the future look like in 2050? Imagine your dream steelworks where iron is produced using hydrogen Based on its world-class steel technology, POSCO aims to realize a hydrogen reduction steelworks based on hydrogen produced without emitting carbon dioxide by 2050, opening an era of decarbonization in hydrogen in the steel sector. POSCO, hydrogen reduction, iron making, Hyrex.